field. Uh, EFX Larry now is on all map for it. And uh, Tim is going to stay, unfortunately, but we're down here. And we just got started hunting, and uh, it's muddy, as you can see, hard to walk, but we can kind of step on these old corn stalks and, and survive. Uh, so far, we've hunted about half an hour, maybe, looking for the hot spot, <clears throat> and found some old bricks and broken glass. And I found a uh, old lead bullet <clears throat> and a piece of junk. Awesome a piece of junk. He's out there hunting still. But I just dug the first coin and came back here to the van to get the camera. And I'll show you a picture of it here. I think it's half time. But uh, I don't know if this will focus or not. I'll try my best. It's not going to do it. So what we'll do is I'll uh, get another video of this here and uh, read it. Okay, here's the uh, half dime. I got a picture of it on the website. I don't know what it is. I just kind of wiped the mud off enough to see that it was a coin. And uh, I'll clean it up here and post it for uh, you to see what it is. Here's the hole the uh, half dime came out of. You can see it's a little wet here. As soon as I uh, dug the hole, it fills up with water. But uh, if you use your knife right, you don't have to get your hands dirty. You just flip the mud out of the hole and wait till the coin comes out. Here's an interesting one that I just found that uh, could be a deep, nice, big silver. Here's what it sounds like. It's right there. I don't know if you can see it, but marked it with my foot. And then on the screen, it's showing that it's uh, walking in the upper right-hand corner, coming down a little bit, which could be half dollar. It's deep. Probably uh, about eight or nine inches. I'll dig it up and see what I got. I thought this was a half when it came out, but it turned out to be one of the, the stamped aluminum tokens from the fair. I don't know how old it is, but typically these were out of the 50s and the 40s, so hopefully uh, this is an older one, but I don't think so. Just got a uh, nice 1903 Indian head down about six or seven inches deep. Not too many signals here, but it uh, sounds like there's a few, so we'll keep hunting. No, no, I don't want to get Austin found a, a gold ring. Hold it up here, Austin, show everybody. It's, uh, he brought it over, running. And said he found gold. Oh, of course, I thought he found a gold coin. He dropped it in my hand, and I couldn't believe it. Nice big man, gold, man's gold ring. <clears throat> Rubbed it off on the inside, and it said 18K, but unfortunately after it, it says HGE, which means high gold electrically. And it's not quite as valuable as it would have been, but it's still a great find. And congratulations, Austin.